everybody. It's me, Horde, from uh, Joe Rogan Podcast. Remember when I was on Joe Rogan? How did you find out about DMT? And how did you get involved? Because I, I read something about you. Isn't that fantastic? Okay, before I start my review, I'd like to address something. Firstly, please like this video below. Also, from the last video regarding Nancy Pagan, I got a little excited and started detailing some sexual acts I perform, free of charge, if you were to donate to Nancy's Patreon page. Now, everyone seems to think I'm some kind of depraved sexual deviant. Okay, yeah, I have participated in Otto Flacio, and on occasion, will invite some of my fans to take pictures of me and let them shove my head into a toilet and then stick my finger in a light socket at the moment of climax, which electrifies my jism, culminating in an emotional fireworks show of ecstasy. But other than that, I'm not some kind of sick fuck who's obsessed with weird sex stuff. Now, if we can put that behind us, I'd like to start with my next review. Today, I'll be reviewing my favorite metal musician's sexual positions. Now, how I obtain this very personal information is irrelevant, and I appreciate your privacy for me and my family at this time. Number 1. Dirty Snatches This is where you eat out the dirty homeless woman who hasn't cleaned out her panties. This gives the appearance that one has grown a big, bushy brown beard. A favorite of Carrie King and Brett Hines. Number 2. Fingering To put one's fingers in another person's orifices. Classic and respectful. I give it two thumbs up. This is surprisingly a favorite of Tommy Iommi. Number three, glass bottom boat. This is where one crawls beneath the glass coffee table and gazes lovingly above as your partner takes a hot do seemingly on your face, but without the cleanup. A favorite of Lars Ulrich. Number four, missionary. This is where you join the Mormon church and travel door to door bothering people. Also six, enjoyed by Visigoth. Number five, we have the scary wheelbarrow. This is a variation on the traditional wheelbarrow in which you're holding your partner's legs and they're walking backwards down a flight of stairs, a la the exorcist, enjoyed by Jerry only. Number six, total recopulation. That's where you and your buddies titty fuck a lady with three boobs, favored by the members of Arno Cole. Number seven, rusty trombone. Eating ass while giving a hand job. This gives the illusion of playing the trombone. Enjoyed by the band Painkiller. <laughs> Number 8. The Cape Canaveral. This is where you bury your erection into the sand, then shoot the model rocket into your ass. Favorites of Hawkwind. Now that's what I call space rock. Well, that's it, and let me reiterate, I am not some kind of sex freak, and if you have anything to say about it, write it down in the comments. Also, please like this video and subscribe and tell all your friends. Hit that bell, smash that bell, stick your dick in that bell. Mash your vag all up in that bell. Stick that bell up your ass and go to work and don't tell anybody about that bell. And then come home from a long day and have a nice long fart that expunges that bell. Okay, until next time, this is Org. I love you. Dungeons and Dragons.